Okay. Well, I mean, we're we're basically here now. Yeah. We're Mega Man that. Battle Network Two. Yeah. Uh, that and that and uh, Kingdom Hearts we've been leaving behind, so we got to pick back up on those. I thought my brother, because uh, my brother is coming to visit me today, or uh, for like a, the next three days, and uh, and I thought he'd be here earlier, but uh, he's gonna be here in the evening, so yeah, we have time to stream. Yeah. So. <clears throat> Uh, I, when do I have to leave? I need I need to leave at like, one thirty something like that. So we got time. Uh, yeah, got a couple hours. We got we got a cool music track when we booted up the emulator, but it fixed itself when it reset. Yeah, it, it removed the the more like obnoxious instruments in this track to make a a pretty sweet like. Just you mean the just, main instruments? Yeah, the, it, I'm saying it's a, it would be a, if you added like some trap beats, it would make for a good trap beat. <laughs> now it's just a Machine Girl song. Yeah. Okay, so last time we left off, the internet was frozen. Oh, Literally. Was... Wait, that's what? Oh yeah, that's what happened. <laughs> We're in. uh... Not gonna lie, it's a kind of monotonous, kind of tedious part of the game. Oh, uh, yeah? Well, good thing we're getting through it now. So, uh... We, uh, we, we broke, like, a bunch of ice, and we, we had to, like, come back so we could break the next level of ice. Now we can break red ice. Cool. Red ice? I thought you needed blue fire to do that. I guess not. No, not in this game. So we got the. Let's go to Yumland. We need to go to Yumland. We need to go to the Chinese networks with all their with all their weird spyware. Were they the ones we robbed? You know, yeah. the national treasure. Yeah, we yeah, and we're heading back there. Let's go and fight it out. Yeah, sure. Get get Gateman level three. Or do we already have Gateman level three? Uh, I d I don't think we do. Do we? Yeah, we do. Oh, okay. We don't have number two. That's uh, that's the only one we don't have. Yeah. We, we well, maybe we have wanted, two. I guess. Do we have two? We don't have two. You won't dishonor me any further. So you need to do well, but not perfect. Yeah. Yeah, just just not doing Gator. That's probably for the best. No. Yeah, that's eighty per. That's pretty good. Oh, that's right. That's normal Gate Man, not uh, not Gate Man Five. Damn it! <laughs> oh, wh why? Uh, oh yeah. Oh, I should I should have had the the pluses for that. Oh, oh. Okay. No. I'm gonna stay. Fucking hell! Gonna stay in the Auto back. Hey, that was pretty good. That combo. Yeah, I, I would like Gator now, but I'm not getting it. No. Oh. There we go. Oh, that's right. It's it's not the first row of theirs. It's right in front of him. Oh. Probably taking too much damage for this one. For version two? Yeah. Like, oh. So I guess we well, can you hit him with a Zeus hammer. Yeah, but he's still uh, he's still got just slightly too many. That's not okay. That's fine. Probably three. Five. Okay. Better than you expected. Still not enough for two, though. I need to get, like, seven or eight. Or nine. Do well, but not perfect. That's, that, that's the hardest thing it to do. Is, yes. It's to make yourself slightly shitty. You either make yourself not good at all, or you go all out. There's very... Well, we need to... We need to get better without relying on Gator, is the problem. 
Well, I mean, that's impossible, but... <laughs> it's, it's we'll, we'll, we'll get, like, better chips and such. We'll get there. Yeah. But it's, like, the final move in, like, uh... In, like, a shoujo anime series. You gotta use it to finish them off. What happened to Yoshi? You guys realize playing it was aging you a year for every hour played? <laughs> yeah, I'm 31 now! <laughs> I only intended it to ever be a one-off, honestly. I was tempted, but not that much. That was, that was a let's see how this goes stream for me. And, and we saw how it went. How'd it go? Not go you can use one of the gators, you got two of them. I could, or I could just go to all three of them at once. No! God damn it. He knew what he was doing. Ice? You can't melt ice! No. Nope. That's so bizarre! It is. It's just, you know, just uh, those technical glitches. You need it. Can't go to Netopia. Uh, what? ONBC? ONBA? I wonder what that stands for. I don't know. Official Net Battler Code of Not America? Oh, are people here now? Has this place finally been recolonized after it was lost in that, like, disaster? The spooky ghosts. Okay. Spooky, murderous things. Yeah. Just. <laughs> S ranked. This is not what I expected from a Mega Man game. You, uh, you never seen Battle Network? Charles? Yeah, it is very different from, uh, like, obviously the platforming Meg Mega Man games. Yeah, it's, it's a very, it's a very interesting game, design-wise. Like, they, they have, they were on Game Boy Advance, so it's not like they couldn't do a, like, a, a, a platforming game. It, it's a Mega Man RPG, but even then, it's, for an RPG, it's got a very unique battle system going on. It's 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 more it's more in depth than just grind up your stats and then and then fight using a, an eight faux ATB or turn based system. It's part RPG and part like card game. Yeah, it Get and, more and, rock and, Yeah, it's the better it's the better of the two between this and Chain of Memories. But yeah, by far. <laughs> There are people who legitimately like Chain of Memories, and I'm like, well, you guys are you guys are pretty cool then. Like, I I can't I can't play Chain of Memories. Yeah. I just. I'm glad it was able to bring someone joy. It had an audience. That that's more than I expected out of it. I, I and this kind of goes with the kind of person I was if I was ever a cynical asshole in charge of like a game studio. I probably would look at that with some skepticism and be like, uh. I don't know, guys. Yeah. Speaking of, uh... Speaking of things that aren't amazingly popular, but have some level of audience. Yeah. Uh, GT Goku's gonna be a fighter in Z. In, uh, Fighter Z. Oh! Oh, that's... Wait, this... That was kinda cool. The small one? Yeah. <laughs> kid blue shirt Goku. Uh, I guess that's, uh, better than, than, like, Dragon Ball Goku... Who, uh... I, I think... Is Kid Goku might already be in the game? With, like, his Dragon Ball Classic moves. Kid Goku versus GT Goku? Yeah. That'd be pretty one-sided. Oh, man. No, okay, how about this one, then? You have Kid Goku, right? Yeah. And then and then GT Goku gets sent back in time to meet his kid self, and they have adventures. He got sent back in time! Yeah. <laughs> they would be very similar. Like, yeah. I, even after all that time, Goku's not really that much more wizened. <laughs> I, a little bit. You, you can kind of tell from the way he acts in GT. <laughs> he just fucking rolls with it. Yeah, it's, just, it's like Lance Steel, Time Displaced Medieval Knight, and Lance Steel, Time Displaced Medieval Knight. Let's see how this goes. I, I'm gonna use Zeus Hammer. I wonder if they all if they all die, maybe I don't take the damage. Well, let's see. Nope. It's, it's, it's Still insane. got it. So, for... So, it is 200 damage everywhere. It's just yeah, you know. Yeah, it, it, you're gonna get you're gonna get like like damaged by it as well. Yeah. I thought you'd skip this one because. Uh, I did because it wasn't a good chip, but you know we're gonna need it eventually for collection purposes. So. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, we got geyser. Yeah, that that's. that's Only right. works on empty panels. What? No, I just I've seen what you had. Yeah, oh, hey, roll. 
I'm gonna eat the other half of this sandwich. And I know you'll disapprove, but I haven't eaten anything last night, so it'll make up for it. Yeah. This reminds me of something, but I have no idea. Kingdom Hearts chain of memories. <laughs> that wasn't even... Here's the thing. Does that count as an RPG? Sora leveled up with stats, right? I... Did he... I think so. He does in normal Kingdom Hearts, obviously. Yeah, I think he But it's... You know, it's it's also a hack and slash, so... I would've... Did you come here to save me? No. Now I can contact Mail. She must be... Hold on. She must be worried about me. Did oh. you catch that? I... <laughs> this game is full of typos. It like... is. They churned these out pretty quickly, and, and you can tell from the translations. <laughs> the net seems different than usual. Well, job done. What are, what are all these memes doing here? Gotta get some info for... Oh, okay. I guess we're supposed to get info now. Get info about other ice... I like how you can jack out directly, jack in directly, but you can't, like, instantly, like, do a teleport jack to anywhere else. Nope. Hey, Dr. Light, if you can teleport me into the base, why don't you just teleport me into the boss robot room? <laughs> it doesn't work like that, Mega Man. But you can these, teleport These are sciences out. beyond your understanding. But you can teleport me out, like, pretty quickly. How come you can't do it in reverse? Who is Doc? Oh, this is probably what we need. Doc, Doc, Can Doc you Hammer? What's going on in the world to me? T today? Ice so appears. There's ice all over the net. And natural disasters are occurring. Doesn't seem like the two are related. <laughs> there's a rumor that they are related. <laughs> I'm just picturing like just a, the, a musical sting of like, duh. That reminds me. A friend, friend told me about the undernet. Do you know it? You I'm just, it's just Karasu. It's Karasu the creepy vampire fucker from Yu Yu Hakusho. Just <laughs> typing on his little keyboard. To access the undernet, you have to uh, join the, the necromongers. There's an undersquare where nasty types gather. Is that like a Pokemon type? And they, and they even have a boardroom. They say if you post a keyword there, a navvy called the Doc will appear in Undersquare. <laughs> he makes cures for any kind of virus. There's a great informant in Undersquare that they say knows the keyword, but... <laughs> oh, no one here will go check it out. Sounds spooky. Urban legends are fun because you can't verify them. Is it mail from Doc? Is this him? Oh, uh, Doc... Thank oh. you so much for looking for roll. I've got a bad feeling. Oh, yeah. roll up version three. Uh, how uh, how useful is this one? Probably not at all. I'm gonna guess a hundred damage. Yeah. Hundred damage to one, but it heals you for half. It improves in the next game because roll becomes a multi-hit. Oh, nice. Yeah, and that then, is so then it stacks good. with uh, you know plus ten and such, really well. Can we get it in the undersquare? So we gotta go to the underverse. <laughs> yep. And that's in Netopia. So, how, how the fuck do we get Onba code? Uh. Oh, wasn't there something we were doing it? We had a job in Yumland. I think so, yeah. We were like blocked off because of the ice. Yeah, you go to Yumland, you find the Navi wandering around. God damn it. <laughs> I forgot about it too. Like, I'm wondering if we can get Onbi Onba code from one of the jobs. Because otherwise we have to fucking fly back to uh, America Europe. <laughs> There's an earthquake happening in Japan, I need to go to America to solve it. Just to just, just to be able to log, log into their internet. Which, from which we can get to the <laughs> undernet. <laughs> Somewhere on the net, purple color and delicate. All right. Yeah. Delicate. So he's a small purple robot. Man, which uh, which squares have I unlocked? I know we got at least one of the like hub codes. 
I think the... The music and, and, like, shot going on in the overworld reminds me of the space station and cyberworld levels from Shadow the Hedgehog. Oh, <laughs> fuck you! Oh, yeah, we, we don't have the right ice to, like... They, they blocked our warps off! <laughs> oh, hello. Hey, it's Windman! He's what, what are you up to? I, I'd like Gator, but I don't have no Gator. Oh. I like how you're like, ah, oh, fuck, and then, and then Air Man appears. I'll just, uh, I'll just, I'll wait for Gator. Can you run from this fight, or are you locked in? Oh, uh, we can, yeah. Still, no. God damn it. Not enough wins and fans anymore. Nope. That's a shame. Get me in level one, and then you have to... That's pretty good. Like... Tis very good. Because it rhymes, wind, fan, gate, man. Yeah. Gator. And. Dead! What really is the difference between Wily and Robotnik? Uh, I think Robotnik at least varies up his shit a little more. It's always eight. It's always a castle with eight robot masters with Wily. It's the same shit every single game. Maybe it'll work this time! No. Eggman's got. You got a lot of plots. Also, why Wily does seem more like directed though, because he like, he wants world domination, right? Mm. Eggman doesn't know what the fuck he wants. He's one of those undefined goal villains. I, at the end of the day, all he wants is to fight Sonic. I Pretty think. much, yeah. Well, that's kind of what Sonic X posited. Well, I didn't want to actually kill anyone. Yeah. Their, their relationship is like, are like, uh, like, a, a hero and, and his arch nemesis. We played through the first game in this in this series, and it's kind kind of underwhelming. The series took off more with the second one, and that was the one that I knew like a few people in school had. For example, was Battle Network Two. Also, I think I think uh, Robotnik is a better like. Uh, Robot designer than, uh, or Eggman is a better robot designer than fucking, uh, uh well, Wily. Wily, a lot of his robots are just like, they're stolen. Yeah, he's, that's the thing. Wily doesn't even, like, make his own robots. He just has to steal them and modify them. Like, we're, like, Eggman is the one who builds, like, all, like, the really cool shit. And it, that can only be bested by Saiyans. And he has flying fortresses and shit. You know yeah. who's a better comparison to Eggman is Sigma. <laughs> he, he builds his own giant mechanical forces, yeah. right? Yeah, <laughs> I, he's, a, he's a living virus who yeah. infects like things. Uh, so, so maybe they could. That said, they could totally be Echoes in Smash Brothers. Is Eggman and Wily? Yeah. Disappointingly, so. Hmm. This isn't great. Ow. Oh, hello. This works. That's right, any object they can't destroy, they just vanish once they touch it. Oh man, that's useful. Oh, I can't get in the right column to hit him with Twister because of the stupid ice. Oh no. It's uh, so good. Just. Yep, still going! The fan's still going! I think Robotnik just wants a theme park. That was his goal in one game. Yeah. He... It was kind of out of the blue. I think Sonic Colors was the one? Yeah. And there was also, uh... His play... He's, he comes up with new and, and, and variety... Uh, and, 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 
big variety of ways to just fuck up the world for Sonic and his crew. Yeah. Like, uh... Why would we say that? It's always a different world, though, too. Yeah, it... Is it really, though? Or is it the same? It's a big wide world here. There could be a I big... guess. Yeah. Sega can't decide on what world Sonic takes place in. Or what kind of world. World building? Fuck that. I said this in a previous stream, it's like they want to do the Mario thing where, where they just don't have to really, really worry too much about story or setting or anything. But they try to make it dramatic so it doesn't really work. It... It's... And every game is just like wildly different in setting and plot. It feels like it's from a totally different author and universe. It's kind of like it, kind of like how Legend of Zelda works in modern day. It's just, oh, well, it's all different. No, there's still, like, there's still no noticeable consistencies between the worlds in each Zelda game. That's not in Sonic. That's... <laughs> oh, man, so I, I watched Tisnarker talk about Sonic Forces for an hour. Yeah. Like, at one point, and... Oh, man, it... It is it's so... it's a trash fire? It actually... It, it, it's... From a gameplay perspective, only two-thirds of it is bad. Yeah. Uh... The, Only two thirds. Uh, the 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 new classic Sonic, the Genesis ones, uh, was noted for controlling very oddly. Um, Gatored a couple. Of so games. which was so the which, which was the good one between custom character Sonic and old Sonic? Uh, custom character is the best. Is the one that plays the the best. Yeah. Uh, modern Sonic is the one that plays second best, and. Uh, and the old school Sonic is the one that plays the worst. How do you fuck up with one less dimension? That that's what that's what a lot of people were saying. It was like that's what the guy was saying. Was like, what the hell do you fuck up this badly? <laughs> like Sonic Mania was better than this. Uh, he also it was noting like the like what you were talking about with them wanting to do a more darker and dramatic Sonic game, but. With forces? But they, yeah, but they... And they I talk, mean, they always do that, though. But <laughs> the thing that's kind of crazy about Sonic Forces is that, uh... Is that they're talking about, like, all this horrifying, like, war stuff. Like, oh, they're torturing Sonic. And, oh, the, <laughs> Tails has lost it. Oh, okay. <laughs> and, uh, and, and, and our forces are down by 80%. And they, they just don't show, like, a war horror. It's just... They're all acting like they do it as, because, as Sonic characters. Yeah. They don't change their personalities at all. They just talk about oh, war, get this war aesthetic going. It feels like a bunch of kids playing war. Yeah. <laughs> against their against their cool Uncle Eggman. I swear to God, there is one like cutscene, right, in which you got a bunch of Sonic characters just doing the whole like war charge, like ah, just running at a bunch of robots in the middle of a field. Yeah. <laughs> The laziest fucking war scenes. It's hilarious. Sonic Force is, is is it feels like it'd be good enough to play and just bad enough that you just laugh at the cutscenes. Yeah. Like a, like a more ironic uh, Sonic Adventure 2 or Sonic. Well, I'd say it's got more more plot than Sonic Heroes. So. Yeah. I would say it's better than Sonic Heroes. Yeah. Uh. Especially if, uh, if one-third of it's noted to be a pain to play through. Sonic Heroes, the plot just kind of appears out of nowhere at the very tail end. <laughs> oh, by, by the way, you know how you know, you know how a game story gets really stacker and you have characters talking about the power of friendship? Yeah. Yeah. You got you, what about Sonic talking about the power of friendship with the with the fan character as they're beating the final boss? Yeah. In this war, dramatic war game. Well, friendship is the most powerful weapon we have. <laughs> it feels like a big fuck you to the people who wanted a more dramatic Sonic story. Were there those people after Sonic 06? A lot of the Sonic fan content is, like, dark and edgy in nature. Yeah? Like, oh. Like, th th there's... There's oh there's a uh, you know what what the the guy made as his like Sonic OC what so he first started what it started off wanting to make Gromit you know because he's British Wallace and Gromit yeah, yeah. <laughs> but that didn't end up working out so then he switched he pivoted 
to uh, design a character, like a buddy character called uh, Trauma the Rabbit. Okay, because because war because war is horrible. But then he realized, oh, this isn't gonna work either. So you know what? He's like, you know what? They've got an edgy Sonic OC. I'm gonna make a Sonic uh, edgy Sonic OC. Yeah. And he made Gun the Wolf. Okay. Because he's got a gun. Yeah. That's the main character. Except it's not like a, like a like a pistol, like a semi-automatic, like Shadow was holding. Yeah. No, it's just this car. It's just this weird energy gun. Of course, the, yeah. the real guns would be too violent for heroes. Yeah, it's like a. It could be a flamethrower. It could be like an electric like whip. It's. Shout out to Yumlin's vol vomit colored background again. Oh. That's good. That's what the the virus did. It hacked the. <laughs> the sad music is still here. Hello. Did you not find the Navi? Buddy, are you here? I, did, I didn't find him in the Yumland net, no. Oh, no. I didn't look. I probably didn't check every... Yeah, oh, he's just yeah, hanging out. You are. He, he's had a fight with his friend, so he's hanging out in the empty place with the sad music. <laughs> he makes me do everything for him. He should do his own homework. Gee, what do you think, Mega? <laughs> This is all his fault. He came. I'm gonna stay here and mope a while. <laughs> Tell him I won't be back for a while. Uh, <laughs> Alright. No, you gotta go get him and bring him back. <laughs> we robbed this place. Yeah, we did. <laughs> all that from the, from the main computer lab. Desperately trying hey, to what's get... that kid doing, like, jacked into the, like, the main government computer over there? That's Lan Hikari. We'll let him do as he pleases. <laughs> He's just checking security. You really found him? He's not coming home. I need some time to think. You know, my Muppet life. <laughs> That's oh. it. That's not what. That's not what we needed. All right. Next quest. I, I guess I'll just keep an eye out for ones that might require uh, going to a certain like uh, area, because the, the the net being frozen over is going to make navigating very difficult. So save every time you accept a job. Yeah. Who are you? I saw you. I found it! Here you go! Get in three. Thanks. Armageddon? Which one's it that? turns everything poison! Oh. All panels. Which combos well with air shoes if we had that, but we don't have that. Where do we get air shoes? That's the bug frag shop. Oh. <laughs> How much cash do we have? 68,000 zenny. We can buy all the capsules. <laughs> I need 50,000 <laughs> pennies immediately. If business picks up again, I'll pay you back. Uh, no. Yes? But, but we'll lose all that, out all, out all that money. How, what guarantee do we have he's gonna pay us back? I'm gonna hold you accountable, old man. I'm Lan fucking Hikari. Yeah. I have a license to kill in this country. By the way, I found the pictures. You better pay me back. Gee, where the, where mister, the fuck I didn't know you could do that him? with a sheep. What? Where the fuck are we supposed to meet him? Uh, big mansion in ACDC town. Oh. He's just hanging out at Yai's place wishing he had money. <laughs> We're gonna go there. It's hey, gonna be niece, like... you wanna lend me some money? No. Gonna go there, it's gonna be just Ollie the bum. <laughs> I swear I have a good idea for business! <laughs> Wait, is he inside? What you the fuck? You dude? creeper! Hiya, kid! I've got a favorite. He just he's just a, a salesman who Yai didn't let inside, but then he came inside anyway. What are you doing here, mister? I need money desperately. I heard she was the richest girl in town. I'm running a disaster prevention agency. D the DPA! But the government does that. What? So he's a, he's a grifter. Nowadays, those net battlers do all the work. We don't have any work to do. 
But that will change, certainly. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I need you to loan me lots of money, 11-year-old boy. You want to know what I'm doing here? The girl who lives in this place, let me hide here. Yeah, I like... <laughs> from the loan sharks. Oh, my... Oh, my... <laughs> Well, at least, at least he addressed the elephant in the room. <laughs> Good news! Natural disaster! <laughs> what? That was like five seconds! Maybe he just hadn't heard? <laughs> Maybe? Okay, I got, a, I got a theory. He's been in this slump, right? Yeah. His company's scraping the bottom of the barrel, he's in debt. And then he got really paranoid one day, because he, he, he was like he was like doing a bunch of methamphetamine. So then he, the ground started shaking. He thought that was just natural because of the tremors. He just suffers his own body. Yeah. They got paranoid. He sees people coming to him because he like runs the place. See, and he thought they were loan sharks. So he fucked off. He had yeah. a conversation with who he thought was the owner of the mansion, right? And. It's a beast actually it was delicious. just a statue. Yeah. <laughs> you let me in, let me here. Thanks, Mister. Then, then the kid, then Land comes out after he like sobers up and realizes, oh wait, a disaster's going on and you need me now. <laughs> he realizes yeah. he had the money after all. He promised to pay it back with interest, so there you go. He's out fifty thousand and and uh, and, he, and he's uh, and he's never doing meth again. Because otherwise, what the fuck? There's a natural. We're in a slump. This earthquake's happening, but I guess they're not coming to us to solve it. This is a job with a paywall. Hey, you have 50,000 zenny? Good. Have 100,000 zenny. The rich get richer. Just took a job from a guy in a telephone. <laughs> Hello. Where are you? Uh oh. Security measures. If you play Shadow, will you 100% it? Probably not. Probably not. Just because there are like 20 something endings, right? Yeah, it, it requires playing a lot of levels multiple times. I really don't have the patience for that. We'll see how it goes. We'll see what it's like. Right on time. This is the bad Navi that's harassing me. Hey, Let's bad see. Navi. <laughs> I, oh, want, I want in. <laughs> oh, oh, period. Let's go. He was actually a shrimp this entire time. Okay. Got. Oh, there's two fans. Damn it. Damn. Yeah, perfect. Uh, that's just enough. That's eight shots, so I guess I'll just get rid of one of the fans. Oh, wow. They got a lot of health. Good thing you got a flamethrower. That's right, I do. Heh, <laughs> idiot. They're not gonna come down at the same time. No, they won't. Yeah, that, that was... Gator wouldn't have really helped there. Nah. I mean, you killed, you literally deleted him. I've had trouble handling the bad navvies around here. Oh, what? he was part of. He was like a, that was like a gospel mook. Oh, he got the their co passcode. That's right. All right. Oh, I think that lets us like open a bunch of the like random security cubes around the net. Oh, you think? Oh, it's like a. It's like a. It's like remember the key? yeah, like the last game they had the 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 Wiley the World Three Gates. 
So that just get, like, gets gets us access to a bunch of like hidden stuff around the net. Cool. You ever play uh, Paper you're, Mario games, Charles? You're telling me you let them have access to our top secret security key? You it fell in the hands of Land fucking Akari. Don't blame me if your navy gets deleted. <laughs> Did it smiley face? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's, uh... Rabita? Yeah. No, but I've seen them played. This is basically the same as the, the Trouble Center in Thousand Year Door. It's just a bunch of a bunch of jobs you can do for a little extra things. Yeah. Although I would say generally the rewards in this game are uh, better than the ones in uh, the Paper Mario optional sections. Yeah. Really the only good ones were the, uh, like, the minigame passes... And even then, those are only good for getting Danger Mario. Let's begin our research! <laughs> oh, is that all? <laughs> all right. Yeah, it's a little short, but that's okay. <laughs> oh, that one's gonna be a bit harder. Yeah. Proto block or I'm gonna do something a little weird. Come and get me. Oh! Damn it! I was hoping the, uh, I was trying to reflect the mask, and it, it kind of worked, but it didn't destroy it like I was hoping. Nope! God damn it. Oh, and that's, the bottom one's not gonna go. And the guy's mouth is closed. Well, this was a farce. That'll do. It's just hit it really quickly. Yeah. There you go. Good thing you weren't ranked for that one. Uh, sparkler cloudy. <laughs> if only. Just throw 200, like... I mean, it would kill them, but... It wouldn't really be conductive to... No. Uh, yeah, my hats. Oh, okay. Don't really have anything amazing here. because they're in the air all the time. How many's left? Two more, I think. I, I saved first. I'll just have to do the gauntlet again. Oh, Gator. About time. Wind. Fan gate yeah. gate, okay. OP combo. <laughs> cool. What would you guys think of tiny flat guns you put on your patio to shoot down hornets? They would have to be very accurate. That that's a thing that Oh, you can't use the no. hammer because that would kill you as well. Got two gate men. Drop the 
time bomb. <laughs> Just to get rid of it. Alright, now they can't go past that. Yeah. He survived! A little slow. And then Mega Man was deleted. Not by World 3, but by, by, a TV, gospel. by a TV station conducting a test. <laughs> that, that people will accuse, uh, like, them of trying to cover up, uh, something. Lan, you risked your brother's life on a TV station job? I'm proud of you, son. <laughs> yeah, then, then, then Lanny Kari breaks down. damage I didn't need to take. You can always... Yeah, the Zeus hand... Oh, that's right. They go fast now. Nah. Yeah. I was gonna say, uh, the Zeus hammer would be a good, like, nuclear option if you really need... If you have the health to spare, you really need to, like, clean... If I have the health to spare. Yeah. You need to clean house. Still alive. <laughs> Next. Oh, this one. Goofball. This one is designed to drain your health. Got this, that, got that silver fist. Got a little cloud. Uh. Hey, that worked. Damn it. Well, that lasts a while. The what does? The uh, him being open. The goofball being open. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Just time it when he gets up and then when the guy opens his mouth to shoot. I'm not going to be able to hit the goofball. But I'll be able to hit the other two. Could have been worse. That's better than the alternative. Isn't the Zeus hammer the super weapon from that Final Fantasy movie? Uh, that was Zeus. It was an orbital weapons platform designed to fire a gigantic fucking laser beam. Yeah? <laughs> it, <laughs> the guy was like, yeah, we'll use this to kill the, the giant shadow threatening it. Then the, the side is like, no, if you do that, you'll hurt the Earth. I mean, like, cause a giant hole in it. No, you'll hurt its spirit! And the military dude, whose whole thing is all about, like, fucking just just being a military guy, he decided to kill an enemy. He was like, you, you're fucking serious right now. Aren't you a scientist? You can't believe it's spirits. The spirits within. Yeah, that, that's the one. It, it was not a... Was it the... It was, it's not, not a well-remembered movie. No, not really. Wow, we're getting lucky with this. This Every particular encounter, we haven't had to fight. Yeah, this this particular encounter seems like it'd be it'd be rough. There's like all the different elements for the most part, and this is the fire one, so we wouldn't really have too much problem with that. This one's a bit different. This one's though. neutral. Does Zeus Hammer pierce? But, I wonder. Does Zeus Hammer affect those guys because they're flying? I wonder. I don't know. I would risk it. Unless you, unless you really... What's the... What's I don't the have a ton else. What's the Navi at the very bottom? That's, uh, Blues. Oh, okay. Sorry, Proto Man. <laughs> Rock Blues. Well, one of them di escapes damage. Sword's kind of useless. Yeah, there. Fuck it. Last encounter. Oh, I hope it hits them. It <laughs> Wait. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I hope it hits. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, it worked. You mad motherfucker. 
<laughs> what an outcome! <laughs> this data is nothing compared to an average Navi. I can't use it as all-purpose data. But it's still valuable. Oh. Hey, you got a power-up! It's good. I, yeah, it's a... Uh... Hey, that, I was hoping I'm for like, like a warp code, but that's okay. That's also good. I guess more charge. Yeah. I, don't, I don't know. Rapid's charge. also useful. I, I'd say charge, and then go to rapid. Just min-maxing. Yep. Until we can final, finally become max-max. Alright, next job. Gotta remain overpowered. Please help. I've heard Electopia's virus busting is top notch. Eh, uh, that sounds like a lot of running around. Netopia Town in Netopia. We have to go there anyway, I guess. Yeah. There's nothing else to do. We might as well. We have to go to America to access the American net in order to virus. To properly virus brust us something that's happening in Japan. Bro, we got a virus brust. <laughs> Did he, I want to fly the next pl plane over to Japan, please. Ten hours America. just to get to foreign nets. Proxies? What are those? <laughs> Land could not get past the sad panda. <laughs> so he flew to Japan. <laughs> We should. Did we? We, we did This we fight video's YouTube? blocked in European countries. Oh yeah, I'm a foreign train to France. Wow, that was a fast ten hours. <laughs> this is. There was a huge flood there. Great deal of damage, to say the least. I fled here to escape the quakes in Electopia. What's happening with Nettopia? It's sunny! <laughs> Wait! Oh. Oh, so it, there's just a sun... Like, a. Uh, what is it? Should always have some ships. Yeah. You don't have unlockers, fuck off. You don't have the subships that really matter. Go through the... It's just the three, though. So how do you... Su how does the system suppress, uh, disasters? Oh! Oh, I oh. could've come... I could've gotten this any time! Oh, sweet! Well, we still had to go to America to get it! Yeah. Don't send it in, like, an email or anything. I guess it's too sensitive. Yeah. No one! No one called the quiz master. But okay. He's got them, like, rocking them Koshi Ripto glasses. Answer my ten questions correctly. Sure. Uh... Is that it? Yeah. Mabita's show? Did you save? Uh, it doesn't... We can retake this as many All times right. as we want. Fair enough. Raxon. Oh. Rattens the chip. What advance occurs when spreaders are in, uh, that, I think. What shape is Okudin Valley's air monitoring system? Uh... Jizo. <laughs> and if you hold your hand to it long enough, you can see how what your friend's relationships are like. The lowest form of trash. A rooster stood at roosters don't lay eggs. Okay. It's a good quiz question, I guess. You can't uh, give birth. You don't have a womb. Oh, so you're being discriminatory, then? Ms. Millions. <laughs> what wood does the bath in ACDC- Everyone just fucking loves Yai's house. It's the best fucking- She's a celebrity, right? I guess. You, know, you think that part of, uh, of ACDC town is like- where all the rich people live. What's in the trash can in Underground Utopia? Why haven't the garbage men taken it? You did it! What'd you get? Oh, get okay, cool. <laughs> go to Netopia Square? If you well, know it wasn't frozen. Yeah. 
You got HP memory too. Get all start getting all the warps just in time for us to not have access to our hub warp. Where I forget where the person we were supposed to meet was at. Oh, I I don't know either. Uh, you got your phone? <laughs> Uh, let me see. The job. What's the job called? Uh, I guess it didn't matter. Game like called. Natopia, four bullies or so. Oh no, it's right here. It's just little ten-year-old girl. I want you to punish four bullies. They're actually gonna be like, like mob bosses. Oh, <laughs> she's she's American Land Hikari. You big bully! <laughs> Bowser eats <a> child. <laughs> You're a big bully. <laughs> Net square entrance. Well, okay. You know what? I wouldn't picture Bowser as the type of person to just, like, randomly eat someone. He seems to be above that. Yeah. Does ACDC have a rockin' soundtrack? If only. Just replace the game's audio with ACDC, uh, like, middies. <laughs> I wonder if somebody ever remixed any of these, uh, like, sounds. The songs? Yeah. Oh, I'm sure. Songs me. I'm sure there are, like, remixes on YouTube. I'm still sad that none of none of this game's music is in, uh, Smash, though. Yeah. It's pretty good music. Na namely the title theme, but... Yeah. It's rockin' title. Shell oh, nerd. Speaking of title themes, I was, I was talking about this before we started, and I forgot, but now I remember. I remember. Yeah. So there was this uh, SNES game uh, called uh, it was called Biometal, and uh, hey, you got it. Yeah. And then uh, and in Japan, it had a, it had a certain kind of soundtrack, like you know you know what a, what a Japanese shooter game would sound like, very like light melodies. Like Toho. Yeah. Biometal was like a, uh, you're just flying a spaceship, though. Yeah. Let's see if I can find an example of the, of the music. Let's give me a moment. No, I don't want to update for a better, faster YouTube. I don't, I don't trust updates. Uh, let's see. Later. Hey, you got get. Oh, sweet. Why are all the little girls the same? Well, that's just all the American little girls. Yeah, they all look like blondes. All, all the, like, Electopian little girls are all the same, too. They all share the same base models, because they all go to the same cult. Although, that said, this game does have more NPC models than the previous one did. Alright, so, uh... Yeah? I have it now. I have the original Japanese soundtrack, and I'll load up the American soundtrack for you to compare. Probably should have loaded that up on the computer. It's gonna sound uh, weird on the phone. Oh yeah. All right. Well, then give me a moment. Because <laughs> <laughs> I just realized this happened, and and it, it's incredibly funny to me. Just just play it. Yeah. Oh, play it on the. Okay. Mm -hmm. You already have it up. Here. So. So here's the Japanese version of the main theme. Okay. Kind of generic sounding. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh... I, I If it didn't have the main melody, then it would just be a Western song. Yeah, so... It would just be a Western game track. So, uh, here's the, uh, here's the American version of the main theme. Yeah. U.S. It's just farts. Okay. You recognize it? Yeah, obviously. <laughs> yeah. So, so for whatever reason, they changed the soundtrack and just put a bunch of two unlimited songs 
for every single track. Okay. Just is that a band? That's the guy. Those are the guys who made that song. Oh. Like, Y'all ready for this? I, I didn't know anyone in particular had made it. Yeah. Yeah, because it's just a, it's just a generic jock jock jam, but it's the most recognizable generic jock jam. Yeah. But yeah, I was I was re I was remembering that, and I'm like, what? how do they fucking get away with that? Yeah. And then it was revealed to me when I was like rewatching footage from the game. The, the band's name is on, like, the title, like, or, or on, like, a flashcard of when you boot up the game. Yeah. It's just, they, they signed off on it. They're like, hey, you want your soundtrack to be in a video game? And then, uh, to Unlimited, we're like, sure. I'm <laughs> just, like, and I just, and I was just reminded of, like, you know what? Uh, Metal Gear Solid Five. it has, it has a helicopter with a speaker. And you can play whatever kind of music you want as the helicopter comes in through its speaker. Yeah. <laughs> just play that song. The, the, it's just suddenly you need gunship support and a helicopter comes in, rockets ablaze, and it's playing that song. Yeah. That's fuck. That sounds fucking funny. Cannon. What's cannonball? Uh, did we have that chip already? I don't. Oh. So it's another one of those. All right. I mean, it is good just because it uh, it it pierces defense. Oh, better, than tree, better than tree bomb, at least. So it's your it's it's uh it's your armor piercing round. They need to like luckily draw. Oh, but Charles has brought uh MIDI ACDC. Sure, MIDI ACDC. Back in black, thunderstruck, dirty deeds for those Dumb, about to dirt rock. Cheap. ACDC is, is, is a pretty... They're pretty good. Like, I, I don't think I mentioned this... In... <laughs> See, this can't get... Uh, this can't get content ID'd. <laughs> no, you're right. Just throw it all on there! <laughs> <laughs> this is some weird droning. I would even... I would generously call that cacophony music. We accidentally scheduled two bands to play at the same time. So we had them do their... do their sets at the same time. I guess you guys will just have to share the stage. They did that. The South uh, Park episode. Oh, there was a... There, there was an episode of, like, Conan O'Brien. Apparently, he ac they accidentally booked two comedians to go at, like, the same night. Yeah. But So they t so the two comedians worked it out, and they're like, no, we'll perform at the same time. Yeah. And so they basically did their bits, which are completely, like, uh, like different type styles of thing, at the same time, without ever reacting to each other. It was pretty, it was a pretty surreal thing to see. Yeah. Just, because one of them was, like, doing audience interaction, and one was doing, like, a whole song routine. Yeah? Like, with, like, a, like, got a character from the, a guy from the audience, and, uh, like... Just not acknowledging each other at all. No! <laughs> Which meant that they, that they planned it out beforehand. They're like, okay, we'll do our acts, and we won't interact with each other, and it's gonna be hilarious. And they're like, yeah, I agree. Okay, so just beat up four dudes. You can do that. <laughs> the little UFO dude, like his hands, I was like, eh. I'm gonna fight ya. I'm gonna fight you. Oh, I got, uh, I got Bruce. Bruce. Blues. Blues clues. Just him and Sean doing detective work. <laughs> hey kids, do you know where, where the enemy virus is? Good old flamethrower. I'm a flame. <laughs> Flamethrower, you. It's. I wouldn't call that like the most. Uh, I, w I was gonna say I wouldn't call it the most dignified way to go out, just being burned to death. Yeah. Oh hell. Oh no, that's 120, not 180. Damn it. That's crazy. That's like Skullman levels of powerful. 
I think Proto V3 is 180. So are you gonna hit? Fuck! anything for, uh... No. Just use Gateman V3 on that thing. Oh! Whatever. That was hardcore. You really... <laughs> yeah? 11 seconds. The time that would be impressive in any other game. Well, you know what's impressive here? 0.6 seconds, because I, it's implied that the chip selection and stuff is is not taking place in, like, actual combat. Yeah. I'm assuming this time is in-universe somehow. So, so this is all stuff he can, he, he can prepare and react to pretty much immediately once he, uh, once uh, something begins. Sure. Like, Navi's reaction times are off the fucking charts. And I guess it's especially just, Mega Man's. It's really just the programming that's happening. And then uh, everything else is on... Uh... Oops. The, all the Navi stuff is in, is instant. It's like that uh, platforming game you mentioned where it's just like the pre-planning. Oh, oh and then uh, you just Katana just, Zero, yeah. And then you just watch the action happen. <laughs> like, he just that's... plans his actions and then he does them. It... That's not quite how Katana Zero works, but basic same principle, yeah. It, it's just like him just, them just like, okay, this is what I'm going to do. Threat analysis detected, and then they execute the program. That's why, the, that's why they say battle routine set yeah. and execute. Because they have routines in case they encounter certain types of... <laughs> oh, two of them, huh? That's why Land Hikari is like a superior net battler. Yeah. Because he, he, he knows his security in and out, which means he knows how to get around Navi's defenses. He's programmed that into Mega Man, who can execute the battle routines... Well, I was gonna say flawlessly, but it all depends on the player. Yeah. I got fuck all for this encounter. Flames. Here we Gator. go. Oh, you got you can do it twice. Double Gator. No, I, I only have five slots. I wish I could double Gator. Yeah, it's fine. You, you got the one Gate Man, and next turn you got the other Gate Man in case yeah. you in case. Just in case, ever in just in case we need two Gators. All right. You gotta wait for both of their stuff to be open. Yeah. I don't think that's gonna happen though. Yeah. I don't know. Oh. Oh, it's too early. Well, okay. Gator. More wind! I don't know how long they have left on it. Okay. Got him. Thank God it homes. Yeah. Small miracle. Do you have any life ups? You probably need them. We're done. I mean, we just got the four. Oh, okay, cool. So that was the hardest of the four. Can we get it in the undersquare? We'll, we'll find out this, later. Is that the undersquare? <laughs> you have to go through her. Ms. Million's purse. laptop or her purse is the closest entrance to the underworld. Of course. That makes sense. I like strong people. Tee hee. Here's your reward. Oh. Step sword. Okay, thanks. It married into being a sword. Yeah. <laughs> M. I mean, it's more powerful than, than like, most other things. Yeah. The movement uh, advantage probably helps. It's not a bad chip. I was just hoping for another, like, warp code or something. Well, I, we got everything, uh, we got all the jobs, so we can... Off to the undernet! Miss Millions won't relate to commoners. I don't care, I just need her connections. I need her underworld connections. Miss Millions, I heard you've had deals with a Raymond Reddington. 
<laughs> she just talks in rich person banjo speak. <laughs> Ms. Millian says she would be delighted to aid you in your quest. <laughs> oh, man. But, so, right? Reddington's got, like, two types of people on his, on, like, uh, I guess on his general life list. Yeah. People on his blacklist and the people he considers associates. I guess, would Lanikar be an associate or an enemy? Probably an associate. He gets shit done. Yeah. I guess it helps that, that Reddington is, is, like, a criminal, but he's not, like, the type of criminal that could, that would, like, just dick over random people just for the hell of it. Oh, it's that easy. You just walk in. Yeah, this looks pretty under, all right. Oh God. Remember the last game when it looked no different from the regular net? Yeah, now it's got that, uh, that uh, VHS look. You just start encountering random ultra-strong viruses. <laughs> it's just... Oh, oh you I shouldn't be here yet! You're, you, you, you took a wrong turn. Is it gonna be... You got wide Sword A. Did I have that? No. Eh. No. But it's only a Wide Sword. Yeah, I know. I'll, I'll have it because it's a new chip code. I Maybe know. it'll be good for something. Fuck frags. Hello. Oh, uh, slime. Oh, sorry, a null. Zeus Hammer's turning out kind of useless. I'm not getting the chance to use it much. Yeah. As is. Oh. Gator. <laughs> I did, I only heard rumors about Gator at first, and uh, I thought it was like some something that summoned a fucking crocodile. Yeah. That would be the logical assumption. Just. A bunch of crocodiles death rolling some programs. Oh, it's here too. God damn it. Yeah, the it We're not us this time! We didn't do anything! We're just as fucked as you! This is the Moss Isley of the internet. Never find a more wretched hive of scum and villainy. No thanks. Can I can I run? Yeah. Yeah. You're you're ultra you're an ultra powerful uh we have all the power-ups. Got all the viruses. Turns out the undernet is pretty scummy. Yeah, a lot of traps. Long sword. Okay, I guess. Wow, the the drops are kind of like not a lot, of, not a lot of money in the undernet, but people took all that. <laughs> so yeah, this is uh, so this is the the programming ghetto. Sure. Everything here is still on dial-up. Yeah, we can't even explore fully because of this stupid ice. Oh, that was Gator. Oh, well. Oh, hello. You you selling? Spice? Do you... Do you spice? Also, I think I remember who was... Who did that. The what? spice thing? Yeah, the spice uh, when he was playing. I think it was Liam O'Brien. The... The voice actor? Yeah. Okay. Was this part of their, like, tabletop thing or yes. something? Oh. Yeah. Spice? Do you... Do you spike? Oh, attack plus 20. Yeah. Just free attack plus 20. Yep. That's much better than, uh... Attack plus 10, to be sure. Just keep the 10s in anyway. Yeah. What do you get rid Just of? Just fill it with nothing but multi-hit chips. You can get rid of Rock Cube. Yeah, we're not using Rock Cube and we're not using the, uh, the Fist. Yeah. And Lance. Lance is kind of, uh, I guess Zeus Sword is just- Zeus Hammer is just like a trump card, right? <laughs> it's your ace in the hole, yes. Yeah. Trump. <laughs> now every time I picture I'm like, yeah, well here's my trump card draws a picture and it's just Donald Trump looking smug. Yeah. And he, then he throws it at the guy and it cuts him in half. So Kaiba. <laughs> Hit! Go! Blue Eyes White Dragon! <laughs> and it is, uh, Occasionally seen skills throwing <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh cards I, like Shuriken. I will say that I like that, that I, I looked it up and there is a dub change where Kai was like, "I'm gonna use a card. I don't know what it is." And he throws it and then he turns out as a Blue Eyes White Dragon. He's like, "Ah, fuck!" Whereas in the dub, he summons a Blue Eyes White Dragon to attack. Yeah. And he's like, "How dare you use dirty my card with your puny blood?" Yeah. And it's just that comes off as a lot as a lot better. 
because it's more goofy. <laughs> yeah. Wonder if there are any enemy navvies around here. Any enemy navvy? Who we got? Cut. I think Cutman we found in Yumland. Shadow Man is the one we haven't. I don't think we found any Shadow Man. He would probably dwell here. Yeah. Seems like his kind of place. Okay, I'll just walk around you, I guess. What an inconvenience. Oh no, I am slightly inconvenienced. I'm so glad we can run from these things. Yeah. It's, it's, so, it's gonna suck when we get to a point in the game where we can't run from things. If we reach that point. If we, we're pretty overleveled. We like... are. Nice wide wheelchair accessible ramps. <laughs> Does a Navi really need a wheelchair? It's Handyman! <laughs> like, I know for a design choice, like, for aesthetically, but, uh, but, like, are, do, are Navis capable of having their backs broken? Presumably not. They break their necks and become quadriplegics? I mean, that one dude lost his walk prog and just was, it, he was still able to stand, he just couldn't move. <laughs> That's... Your coding is corrupted. It's affected your central nervous system. You can't walk properly anymore. You have to be in, a di in an eye wheelchair the entire your entire life. A wheelchair designed by Apple. <laughs> a e wheelchair, cyber chair. You know what? I bet if Charles Xavier Jack jacked into like the digital world, he he'd want to be able to walk. Yeah. He's that, like, was, that was that was a whole plot point in Paprika. Yeah, the guy. <laughs> he, kind of a shame he was. To... Kind of a shame he wasn't voiced by Patrick Stewart. They can only get him from for Ghibli. Yeah. It's like, hey, you want to do a Satoshi Kon film? Who? No, that's okay. I've seen Perfect Blue. I know how that turns out. But it's about dreams. Huh? That, that's not really selling me. Satoshi Kon can do everything with with his dreams, and then they convince him to see like a. a like a scene uh, from Paprika. Unfortunately, it's the parade scene. He's oh. like, this is really fucking confusing. I'm out. I thought you were going to say, like, the, the butterfly molestation oh, scene. Oh, that, okay. Yeah, no. The, the parade scene would have gotten on board the butter... That weird-ass, like, butterfly scene would have just been... Sticks his hand in her snatch and tears her in half. Uh... Paprika was weird in places. Yeah, you know what? I'd say, I'd say Perfect Blue was, uh... If you, it's still good. Both of them are really good movies. Yeah. Perfect Blue could I, I could possibly see as a tougher watch. Yeah. Because that's that's the only thing like that's the worst that Paprika gets is the butterfly scene. There's like a proper rape scene in Perfect Blue though. Kind of. Well, it's a rape scene in that uh, they it's staged, it's but staged. She, she and, didn't want to do it. Yeah. So it's practically a. You hear? Uh, everyone's apparently flipping their shit. Because they had a Game of Thrones character have a sex scene. In Game of Thrones. Who's, uh... It's Arya. Wait! Arya Stark! Yeah. Who is now eight? Who is now 18 in the show, and her actress is 22. So the, so it's legal then? Yes, but and people all... flipped out because, oh, we watched her grow up! So, I slid, so... I mean, yeah, it... it Man, don't you just love it when the Westermark effect, uh, like, just kicks in for, uh, for, <laughs> for, like, stuff you watch? Ah. What? So this was, this was a recent episode, huh? Ah, uh, yeah, it's, wow. I think it's, like, the they're, latest episode. They're really ending the season with a Get it? I, I think I know who she who she would I don't know anything yeah, about it's, this. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah. It's it's who you're thinking of. Okay, good. Well, not well. Good that I'm right. No, I don't no, care. it's the dwarf. He fucks her. <laughs> He's cheating on his wife with her sister. <laughs> that, that sounds like a Tyrion thing to do, honestly. <laughs> I don't know the keyword to summon Doc, but I know someone who does. Sell you this for ten thousand. Can you, can you sell it for cheaper? It's a purple navi, it's pretty greedy. 
I don't- I think that's a flag trigger. I don't think we can then, like, reset and use that information. Ah! If you want to menace someone, first thing you do is yell! I, I like this. I like how some group called Gospel is pretty influenced, but they can't do a thing alone! If I meet one alone, I'll give him my oh, gospel. Oh, gospel are so fucking corrupt that even that even like a digital the digital gangland doesn't want to work with them. They're like, who are these assholes? It's like these guys are like the classic like mobsters, and then gospel's Joker. This is the secret board. No ordinary people allowed. Oh, so it's okay. locked out. So no one talks there. Shredder. From, uh, from, from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? Ah, Shredder. These are some good usernames. Shredder, Killer, Deleter. <laughs> Iron Bear. Iron Bear is the guy you don't want to fuck with, though. He's, uh, he's just, he's just Bear from Dot Hack. <laughs> Something odd about the bug frag collector in Kodo Square. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that dude. Thought, always thought he was hiding something strange. Bug frags in the collection will turn into real bugs. Think he's planning something nasty? Ooh. Whatever, I got air shoes. You idiot, you got air shoes instead of Zeus hammer. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Wait. Cl oh, not, not to- I got recover 80. Wow, you are an idiot. <laughs> hey guys, I'm here too. Look how sad his post looks. <laughs> the square's proto man is bad news. He's tough. His attacks just don't quit. It's just. I, I can't believe he fought proto man. Oh wow, he's got a John Wick reputation too. Yeah, I use an escape. I just run. Okay, Usopp. Deleted Navi's Rome as ghosts. Yeah, we knew that. Yeah, we've encountered multiple ones. You can get to the internet from a place in Den Area 1. There's a secret passageway. But I guess everybody knew that already. All right, it, so we... uh, it goes to the middle of Lan's hub for some reason. Lan has had a link to the internet all along. Well, he's, he's a master of security, which means he got to deal with both sides. This he... is how he knows- this is how he knows Red. <laughs> And there's like some digital gay. He's like the Landakari is the cop that walks in on John Wick's killing spree and goes, "Oh, you working again? <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> you're not you're not evil looking. Uh, a trap. This is for hundred. That's nice. That's oh, th this guy. This is the toughest guy here. <laughs> this unassuming fuck. Oh, I keep him in line. All right, what do you get? Oh, hello. Oh, power up! Got, oh, got oh. lines. Okay. You want to do a line? <laughs> want to do some lines? God. Now, we can walk on lava, but that only I think it only deals like 50 damage, so it's not that useful for yeah. lava. But it... But it but Grasslets is deal double damage. But the lava's persistent, right? No. Once no? they step on it, it vanishes. Oh. That's disappointing. A grass line do 100 damage. Uh, but, that's uh, a good. That's a decent combo. Yeah. But uh, that's only 100 damage, though. Yeah. It can hit multiple people, uh, but that that all depends on the flamethrower, I guess. So you need to talk to the guy to get uh, the key. The the keyword. Was it the guy who sold you? No. Have I seen you somewhere before? Yes, I bet you have. In oh, a net square. Oh, not the under square, the other square. Well, that's what the guy here just told us. Ah. Well, so you gotta set the flag to go to now the the net the proper net square. Yeah, the Netopia square. Ah. This is not Electopia. Yeah. We don't have to go back over to the American internet. Oh. The Japanese internet? The, the, I thought. Oh yeah, that's right. Their Netopia is the American internet. Fuck this. Is they also can't just call it Japan and America. Just call it Japan and America. Unless, unless, uh, unless Netopia is supposed to be England. 
Yeah? I guess I'll try it. Come up here, Null Man. No, he's gonna stay down there. God damn it. Null Man. Just make your oh, you can heal. That's that's what he can do. Yeah, oh! That's fine. Your reaction times have kicked in. No. He just swoops in with his opening and then leaves. God. There we go. 15 meteors. Another extra chip. So you got the power up, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you, you do rapid fire. Rapid up. It takes a while to get, like, uh, new styles in this game. The ice on the net is generating harmful signals. Wow, you got here fast from the square. Yeah, because it's uranium, obviously. It's, it's radioactive net ice. net uranium. <laughs> How much longer are you going to keep using my computer? Aww, aww. Ma'am, I got some important things to do. I need you to cooperate. <laughs> it's fine. If you cooperate, I won't tell people about... What the fuck is that? Step sword. Oh! Oh! Well, I guess he walks on air, too. I wasn't sure if that would work. <laughs> I'm glad it did. You got another step sword? Oh. Nah. Uh. <laughs> it's always so nice when it happens, just wipes out everything. Yeah. Spice? Do, do you do you spice? Do you spice? I like that, that that's the generic like fantasy drug name is spice. Yeah. <laughs> it's I can't think of anything more more generic of a drug name than spice. Isn't it an actual drug euphemism? Uh, it's a slang for synthetic marijuana. And when I say synthetic marijuana, I mean it's actually nothing like marijuana at all. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh... I feel like I remember that being a thing that was going around for a while. Yeah. Was... That and bath salts. Oh my god. Back pre-legalization, people were doing everything they could to get high. Like, th 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 those were some weird times. Just people doing that and bath salts and... Yeah. And bath salts made you into a zombie. People were thinking, oh, there's a zombie outbreak going on. But no, it was just bath salts. Fuck yeah. But, uh, Spice was also a thing in Dune. Yeah? It was, uh, it had a proper name, it was like Melange or something. But, uh, people used it to, like, uh, to, like, warp through space. Because oh, they didn't have hyperdrives, they just had people just taking a shit ton of spice and just, you know, just bent, tripping so hard through space-time, they end up in other sides of the galaxy. Oh. And then... And it was produced from, like, sandworms? Okay. Somehow. Did they have the ability to jump galaxies? No, they just lived on this planet, and some people found the planet, and they realized that spice is, is, is like, one of the best, like, drugs ever, because it can also extend your lifespan, and can grant you, like, like, visions. Yeah. Uh, it, let me... Let, Pregnant mothers could, like, take, like, large quantities of it, and they pass down their genetic information of their ancestors onto their unborn child, making them, like, like a, like a pre-born prophet. Oh. Dude, Dune was really out there! And, like, yeah. oh, you know what? There was a movie adaptation of Dune, and you know who, who played a character in it? Snoop Dogg. Patrick Stewart. Oh. Patrick Stewart was in Dune as, like, as, like, a mentor to the main character. So, uh, I remember this. We, uh, we went to Net Square, and they said, Oh, I think my friend knows knows the dude. He's uh, he's off on the net to buy a chip. Oh, no. Guess what chip's gonna be out that we're gonna have to get for him. The, what Whatever chip? that chip is, I don't know what it is. Oh. 
You said guess as if you do the answer. No, I, I don't. Oh, he's what do we need to fetch for this guy? It oh. won't be. F it's oh, it's this guy. We just saw him in the undernet. <laughs> Give me your zet. Do I have one of those? Yeah, you should. Oh, okay, oh, good. Good. You said we needed it for something earlier, so. I don't think it was that chip, but I'm glad we had one. Uh, the keyword is. Dun dun dun! So so Doc was a former World Three fixer. Maybe. He he was he was their he was their uh, their street Doc. Oh ho oh ho oh ho! Miss Millions would really like her purse back. I I still I'm still working on something here. You do fuck all. You sit here all day and molest children. You can wait. <laughs> does, does she? she she seemed to be just amused by that notion. The, or, the like, notion of molesting children? I don't know, like... She seemed to be pr getting pretty hot and bothered by Lan. You're creepy, lady. It's okay, he's Lan Hikari. He's a special case. He... I don't... I know not to touch that one. She's actually just racist. She doesn't want any of the American kids because they're all black. Because America. I, I guess there are more black people in America than in in, in Europe, right? I don't know, so wrong. We I don't know. I don't. That's not something I've ever considered. Like how many? <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh no, don't talk about black people! <laughs> we can't acknowledge they exist! <laughs> you know how- <what? laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Fuck it, I'm looking it up! <laughs> I'm sure there's a pop- there's plenty population of, of, of black people in Europe. It's, it's more that, for whatever reason, Nint uh, Nintendo, America is known as being very multicultural, because, you know, America. Yeah. The melting have pot. Any, have there been any, ever any, uh, any, like, major, like, black Nintendo characters? Not, like, main characters that I can think of. It's all, like, it's all, like, white dudes and Americans. Yeah. Zelda, the most Aryan series. Yeah. All blonde hair, blue eyes, pointy ears. Yep, elves. They're all, they're all point, they're all... All elves. Fair folk. Oh, God. I just re Yeah, get... Oh, no! He's green, not black. Okay, yeah. But okay. even so. There we go. Whirlpool. Uh, oh, I guess the, I guess, uh, the Caribbean counts. As... America? As, as, uh... As Europe or something? As Europe. Or... Where's the Caribbean? Uh, it's the Caribbean. It's like, uh... Let's see. Uh... Okay, I found it. Europe has a total uh, country population of 738,800,000, uh, uh, people. And, uh... And it's estimated that 8 million of them are uh, African and African mixed. Of how of how many total? Uh, seven hundred thirty-eight million. There's, there's so it's less a, than. a little a little over ten percent is the estimate. Yeah. Well. Let's see. I wonder if this music would be, like, more or less unsettling on so, a chipset that wasn't Game Boy Advanced. I... I think less. Yeah. The Game Boy Advanced chipset's all already very, uh... Very just weird. Oh, 328 million in, uh, in America. Which is actually half of, like, Europe. What the fuck? Plus, well, How much is the population total in America? That, yeah, I just said it. 328 million. Oh, yeah. Compared to all of Europe? Compared to all of Europe, yeah, Europe has 738 million. 
739 million. Well, that's like a bunch of different countries, so. Yeah, that's true. So, but then again, it's like a bigger, I'd say, a bigger land mass. It's also that, yeah. West Coast America is pretty spread out in terms of population. I think a, a, most of Europe is more comparable to East Coast U.S. Like, people have been settled there in, in like, congesting for a while. Yeah. Let's see. Uh... Alright, go. U.S. Demographics. Not Australian demographic. Actually, I'll you know what? Yeah, that's a good diversion. I want to see... I'll post some keywords. Go to it. Go to it. Alright, it's posted land. If you post this word, he'll appear somewhere in the undersquare. Oh, well, let's take a look. Let's go and meet the doc. Hello. Who are you? Oh. <laughs> I hate that operator! What a cute customer we got here! What the fuck? I'm the doctor! Dr. Eggman! Does your tummy ache? Oh, oh no, he's, he's talking like the, the One Piece doctor. <laughs> a cure? What did a navvy like you do with it? Playing doctor? To break the ice? Sounds fun! Since you've reached me, you must be kinda tough. You wanna fight? But I want all the power-ups and battle chips you've got in ex- FUCK! It Seriously? Is, it is the doctor from One Piece. Yeah, I'll save your life, just give me your life savings. Are you happy? Do you have to accept? Just say- No cure. Better pay the price. You're brave, I like you! Here, take this back with oh. interest. <laughs> Do you think they ever really dropped his level down to one, or they just said they did? I don't know. It's all in one cutscene, so there's really no way to tell. Actually, I was looking into that ice myself. To make the cure yellow cure, <laughs> yellow cure. you need yell frag and heat data. Got myself a yell frag here. Oh, uh, don't go strutting around if you don't got it. Oh, so you need to act. Oh, you need to go to the airport and go grab it from the dude. Uh, no, it's not that dude. Oh, really? We uh, actually, uh. We need to steal it from an oven? We freed someone in a program in Yumland that was talking about heat data. Oh, so we need to go back to China. And that, uh. Now, now they said, oh, I, I'm, I'm away, I'm all on, like, vacation from where I usually work. So now the question is, can we go talk to that program, or do we need to go to the location first to trigger the flag to talk to that program? God. <sighs> this is Don't so you fucking... love flags? Just raise the flag and then run back and forth. It's so, t it's so exhausting. It's just, oh, I got now I gotta make another long trek through random encounters. Fuck. No, I don't have your incredibly rare chips, you demanding little girl. I want your- I want the rarest chips. No, I don't have them. Hey, do you have Bass GX? It's like those fucking guys. There, there are people on the on the Pokemon online, uh, like the online global trade system, that just post shit, asking for like shiny legendaries, like just hoping. Just throw it out there. Maybe some schmuck will make it happen. <laughs> yeah, I'll give you a shiny Moltres for your Ratata. <laughs> like, what do they expect? <laughs> oh man, just I caught a level two Ratata. I want your shiny. So, it's like, hey, uh, I'm looking for ten pounds of gold. If you give it to me, I'll give you this paper clip. Don't uh, don't work your way up or anything. Just go straight for the end, huh? Yeah, just 
trade a Rad Tef for a Pidgey, trade a the Pidgey for an Abra, trade an Abra for a... Uh, Jinx, I don't or know. Jinx. Just work your way up. And then you... Okay. <sighs> Where are you, programs? We're, we don't need to grind, I'm glad. I'm glad grinding isn't a thing. Flamio, Hotman! There's a guy in, in Metal Gear Solid with the name, uh, Hot Coldman. Yeah? Oh. Oh, good. We Because we saved that guy, we needed to come here. So, would we have had to come here, normally, we would have had to come here, find out about that program, go to Yumland, free him, come back here for the heat data. Oh, good. We just sequence broke the game. The stars aligned. Let's get the fuck back to the under undernet. Go meet Red Reddington. Again. Red, I, I got the program. Make the yellow blocker. Oh no, another earthquake! Who's just, who's just leaving their food out on these barbecues? Pigs, that's... Intermittent earthquakes are occurring. Evacuation advisory. Evacuate to where? We're it's gonna, weird that... We're gonna go to space! It's weird that Japan is having the earthquakes and not the floods. Like, you'd think just that the fact that there are earthquakes would lead to floods. It depends on how the fucking uh, natural disaster suppression system works. I guess so. Because they don't really explain it. Well, maybe Electopia isn't, uh, isn't landlocked. Oh, you know, you, you know what the situation is like? It's like that one movie, it's like that one weird movie, Geostorm. Yeah? It's like where, uh, where, like, oh, we had these satellites and they prevent natural disasters. And stuff from occurring, and then oh no, somebody's hijacked and it's causing storms all over the place. Yeah. Geostorm ripped off this game. Let's go back to. It's faster to fly back to Natopia than to go through the like the the Natopian net. Otherwise, just because Miss Million's bag is so close to the dark net. Yeah. She. <laughs> Hey, Red, you think you can arrest this lady? I want her bag in exchange. Just... Well, I don't know. She's a former associate of mine. It wouldn't quite feel right. Well, I felt uncomfortable, like, be. Being... <laughs> I don't know. She just gives to me break the creeps. Up, uh... Red would not... Red would just, just have his, his face palming, having to break up some kind of feud between two of his associates that he actually likes. <laughs> He's a skilled negotiator. He'll negotiate with you, and, and if uh, if you refuse to negotiate with him, he'll kill, he'll shoot you. He's really good at like uh, at just. Cause being like polite and causing people to be scared out of their minds, yeah. even while he's being polite. Like he's like visiting this one like couple, right? And one of them was like a dude who uh, who caused two of his other associates to die. He's like, ah, oh, Stroganoff, that sounds wonderful. Talking to the wife, and he leans over the husband's shoulders, like, I know what you've done. Yeah. And and he's just like goes up to call the cops, right? Come down, and then he's like, oh. Would you like a big plate or small plate? And she's like, oh, whatever works. I'm sure the cops will come momentarily. He's like, what? Jesus. Flashbacks oh. to the scene from American uh, Psychopath. American Psycho. American Psycho, yeah. <laughs> right? <laughs> Just talk talking about Ewey Lewis in the news? <laughs> he, wouldn't, he wouldn't be as, like, high-pitched enthusiastic no. as... Because in that, in that scene, uh... <laughs> In that main, in that scene, Batman and uh, and Green Goblin were <laughs> Green Goblin was black. It was almost like just slot, like sloshed out of his mind, not yeah. realizing what was going on. And and Batman was just like, like ah, oh, without a care in the world. I love this song, don't you know? Just downplaying everything that was wrong about the situation. With him wearing a rain jacket, the cart, the area being covered in newspaper. And him just having an axe. Just, oh, don't pay attention to this! And, you know, I really like the album 4. Uh, I'm going on a bit, aren't I? I, I, I mean, I just mention the scene. I don't know. I don't have a whole lot to add to it. Yeah. 
Uh, as, Just, uh, you know, trekking through the internet again. As is probably common knowledge, you're, uh, you're not really a live-action movie guy. Yeah. Which I, I can respect. I got I got you to watch Fight Club. That was uh, that was certain. That sure was an experience. Yeah. At least we have context for some jokes. Got you to watch The Matrix. Yeah. I, I think I don't know if you like that better than Fight Club. Yeah. Yeah. Comparable, I guess. I said they were talking on Discord about uh, about your uh, your lack of interest in movies, and I, I, I basically said like, yeah, he doesn't like any move any live action movies except for Phantom of the Opera. Pretty much. I have yet to see another that really wowed me. Watch some Rosencrantz and Guildenstern are dead. I, I do... It's not like a super amazing movie, but I remember being uh, kind of impressed by Spider, comparing it to Satoshi Kone, which was a Cronenberg movie. Yeah, that's, that's on our list. Uh... I think I think you were you were at least mildly uh, amused by uh, Time Crimes, eh. that Mexican uh, time travel movie. Was it Mexican or Spanish? I don't know. I don't remember. It, it did ultimately comply with Zelrog's law, yeah. right? Yeah, I found. I was like, this is movie is Zelrog's law compliant, which is very rare. Yeah. Most most movies about time travel know fuck all about understand fuck all about time travel or they don't really think themselves through yeah you, you know what movie would like start to be there was a movie that started to be zelrog's law compliant and it kind of just derailed halfway through yeah and that was uh oh shit what was it called primer that's the one yeah because it started off zelrog's law compliant and then everything kind of just got weird this movie was weird. Not weird in a good way. Weird in a you're directly contradicting yourself kind of way. Yeah. Katana Zero, that was weird in a good way. Katana Zero, I only, I, I only took me like three hours to beat, but it was a memorable fucking three hours. Yeah. How many times have I run down Snake Way by now? Uh... How many times did you die and you have to go to King Kai's place? Take that and, and, and multiply that by two. Kai, man. The godliest net navi. Oh, man. He'd be a villain. He's, is he the final villain in Gospel? Kai, Kai man? man? Sure. Why? Kind of Why guy, villain? Because gods? Because cause I think it'd be creepy to just have an angelic figure just floating down, right? And then you see him and... You just feel, like, immediately calm and relaxed by his presence, and he puts his hand on your head, and you're just... And despite the fact you know he's a villain, you can't help but, like... He just... It's like this weird kind of mind fuck. We'll get to that. <laughs> oh, is, is this game of weird mind fuck? Uh, I don't know. Most of what else you were describing, though. <laughs> Not this game, particularly, but, uh... Three is the one that comes to mind. <laughs> so it can, it's either it only can go either one of two ways an angelic figure just dropping down either it's like the kind of thing where you look and you're just so enraptured by him you can't help but kind of worship it or, or, or whatever or the other one is you look and you're like I'm gonna kick your ass yeah on Jamon He's good again, right? That we're at that part of Digimon where he kind of re remembered, oh wait, I'm a good guy. Was he ever not a good guy? He was possessed. Was he? I think so. Alright, Netopia 2. I, there's someone somewhere Netopia 2 are supposed to go meet. Why do rich people gotta be creepy? Like, it's not just in this game, but in real life, like, you got, you give a, 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 somebody a bunch of money, a bunch of time, and just a bunch of power, and, and they just decide to, you know what, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be fucked with it. They bored, they're bored? They're, what kind of boredom, like, 
You have a bunch of money, you're bored, and you just decide, you know what, I need the hardcore shit? Yeah? From the, the zero to sixty, why don't you build, like, gigantic fucking land parties or something? If you want to have, like, a, a nice party, you build, like, the world's biggest Call of Duty party. Is that how you, that how you kill your time when you're rich? If I was... If I was a rich man. If I was rich, I'd make sure, first of all, that the property I was living in, I could live there for five times my lifetime. Yeah? That way... That way I'd be able to spend more of my money, like, without having to worry about it. You know what I'd do? I'd invest in projects on Kickstarter. Yeah? I'd be- I'd be a notorious, like, Kickstarter backer, or just an investor in general, just... I, I, Mr. I, Anderson! Yes. Alright. Oh, you want your novel published? What's it about? Uh, time traveling cyborgs fighting his uh, voodoo dinosaurs. All right, we'll print five hundred thousand copies. Oh, there's someone trapped in here. We have to save them. Yeah, do we have we have yellow cure? We do. We're just missing blue now. Blue ice is difficult to break. Man. A white sword, or step sword. Yeah, That won't hit all of them is the problem. Oh, it won't? No, because they're all in different... Fuck it. I'll take it. Zeus hammer! You know what we do? We just gotta buy all of the HP memories we can find now. <laughs> just make ourselves a tank who can take the hit. <laughs> we already are kind of a tank. I thought I was a goner when I was trapped in the ice. I lost my little brother. Oh no, Alphonse? No. How do brothers work in, uh... Oh, he's a famous key maker. <laughs> my, my name is Mega Man. Yes, I'm the key maker. Who's going to make keys if not him? Oh god, you haven't seen Matrix Reloaded, but there is a character called the key maker in, uh, in, the Ma in Matrix Reloaded. Yeah? Uh, Neo meets him, and, and you know what he looks like? What? He looks like this, like, this tiny Asian dude with, like, just a bunch of keys and, like, his, like, old clothes. Yeah. He's, and <laughs> it, it's, it's kind of funny, honestly, just, like, because the characters in the Matrix, they're not goofy enough, but there's hints that they could be goofier. I wonder if that influenced Maple Story, because I don't know if you remember, there was an NPC who was, like, a locksmith, and it was a, a very, like, stereotypically Asian dude. That could be it. I mean, Matrix Story. Uh, Ma Matrix Story. Sorry, Maple Story. That's a crossover uh, a lot that of didn't references. happen. <laughs> Matrix Story. <laughs> Hold on. I mean, uh, fuck it. If they can bring Evangelion back into Maple Story, they can do it for other '90s shit. So, top hit is the Keymaker Matrix. Second hit is the Keymaker Dab Pin. The fuck? Okay. <laughs> All right, uh, I have a picture of the keymaker. Hold on, let me zoom in. So the keymaker Navi is somewhere in the undernet. Great. Oh, hello. Oh, you found him? Uh, no, I got I got another step sword. Oh, sweet. From the like mystery data. Cool. Step sword is pretty useful. It's Q, granted, but... That, man, Wikipedia images are always, like, really shitty. Are they? Yeah. Also, I can't really zoom in properly on my phone. For some reason, it just won't let me. Images may be subjected to copyright. Can I just... Okay. This is what he looks like. This is where he finds it. Yeah? Yeah. But see, you can tell he makes keys because he's got keys all over the fucking place. He's got them on the walls. He's in a prison making keys everywhere. He looks familiar. I think That's he... not the dude who voiced Uncle, is it? Uh... Let me check. It could be. All right, Matrix Wiki. Uh, 
the f do, do we, uh, do we know, do we know his, uh, do we have, like, an actor name? No? Not the here? cares about actors? Nobody, right? Randall Duck Kim. Okay. Uh, Korean American. Yeah. Still alive. Chilling in Hawaii. He didn't look that old. He looked middle aged. Uh. Let me see. Uh. He's 75 right now. He was uh, old when he. or older when. Uh. The Hawaiians. Tora, Tora, Tora. Oh, I've seen that. That was from a long time ago. Uh, Anna and the King. He was so, a character. The King and I. Yeah. Uh, Matrix Reloaded. Memoirs of a Geisha. Geisha. A geisha. I remember there was a dude at Job Corps who re rented that almost every day. <laughs> Love that movie. Kung Fu Panda. Yeah. Master he, Uguay. Yeah, he was the master, of course. <laughs> Grandpa Gohan, Dragon Ball Evolution! Okay. <laughs> I did not know that! <laughs> He's the key maker. Yeah. KI. <laughs> I'm just. Neo walks in. Yes, my name is Neo. Oh! <laughs> I'm the key maker! Uh. He was in the last airbender. He was credited as Old Man at Temple. Old Man at Temple? In Temple. Oh, hello. What the? Hi, right, Program Advance! You're becoming Electricity Man. Oh no. We've abused Gator too much. We got the Navi style. <laughs> Allows eight Navi chips, but it's electric type, so it's kind of shitty. Oh, it allows eight Navi chips? That's actually a pretty decent advantage. Uh, that being said, it's still elect style, so it yeah. still kind of sucks. <gasps> oh! What? Oh, he was in John Wick! As? He was the doctor! Like, so there's a scene in which Wick comes back from shooting up that nightclub, and he's injured? And and so he gets a doctor to, uh, to tend to him. He's like, how long will this take to heal? He's like, uh, stitches will take a month. Uh, but, uh, if you, if you really need to take care of business, he give you these, he gives him some pills, and he's like, uh, pills will stop the bleeding. Uh, just remember, limited movement or you'll tear the stitches. Yeah. And he's like, you want some painkillers? And meanwhile, I hit Wick's drinking bourbon, and he's like, nah, I'm good! <laughs> I think he's gonna appear in John Wick, uh, 3 as well, so. Oh, that's interesting. He's got a, he's, he's, There are a handful of, like, uh, of just, like, old man Asian dudes who are just the kind of pool to draw from for old man Asian dude movie characters. Yeah. It was this guy, Mako, and the guy who voices Uncle Chan, who I don't remember the name of. Yeah, it was those three. I imagine those three just, like, chilling at a park together. Yeah. Oh, man, that would be, that would have been a great scene. Just they, oh, they could be like the they could be the the three old men in the in Cowboy Bebop. Yeah, they're doing a, a Netflix live action Cowboy Bebop. I I heard. I don't know how that'll go. We'll see. I I heard also heard that they that they possibly would be dropping Ed from the cast list. Why? I don't know. Does, does, I don't know. Can't, Hold on. can't find a child actor. I know of appropriate race and androgyny. <laughs> Well we, well, we can't get Arya Stark. She's too old. Also, that'd be that would be uh, that'd be blackface. Yeah. Or brownface. Ed is of Ed is of ambiguous gender and race. Am ambiguous, uh, yeah, name as well. That it's as like, well, yeah. It got Just... to a point where the people drawing the manga were confused and thought, yeah, that's actually uh, it's actually a boy. I guess it could swing either way. Yeah. Uh, I shouldn't have tried that. This is a this is an ice virus. I'll just I'll just juke him. Yeah. We do the left. We do the right. 
We do the left. Let's see. American live action series being developed but for television by Tomorrow Studios. Christopher Yost is poised to write the series. Who is Christopher Yost? Uh... Wait. Oh, that's, uh... Hmm. Yeah? Uh, he's a newer writer. And, uh... He's, uh, he's a Marvel guy. Okay. Uh... Next Avengers Heroes of Tomorrow, Thor the Dark World, uh, Thor Ragnarok, Max Steel. I thought that was already a... How'd that... Oh god, how... That looks terrible. How was that? How was what? Max Steel. I've never heard of it. Yeah. Approval rating of 0%. On Rotten Tomatoes? Yes. For Max Steel. But he was only the writer, so... So the, the code of... Many been, there could have been many ways for him to, like, for some people to fuck that up, rather. Oh! Hello. Hey, it's Magnet Man. Just hanging out back here. Oh, he's got a lot of HP. Even Gator won't be enough. Look at the, he got two of them. He can still fly, though, unfortunately. Oh, that's so weird. My flamethrower moves. Proto Man, Gate Man V3. Wait, what? What, what? Nothing. Apparently a guy I, uh, I, a guy whose book I bought once released another book. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh. Oh, damn Daniel it. Daniel Suarez, I think he, I think he was the author of Demon. Yeah. For Demon, but however they pronounce it that time. So, alright, so, so Christopher Yost is the, uh, is the dude... So is he, uh, is he, like, Norwegian? Uh, I think he's just, I think, yeah, he's American. I think his family might have been Norwegian, though. He's from Missouri. But he's currently living in, uh, L.A. Sweet. He's living, he's living the dream. Yeah. Oh, you know, he was a, he was a writer, he started off as a writer for X-Men Evolution. Yeah. Transitioned to writing for the Batman. And then wrote for, uh, and then also wrote for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the, the 2003 series. Or the... The Nickelodeon one? Uh, I th was it Nickelodeon or was it Cartoon Network? No, it was Nickelodeon. Ah, yeah, then, what else did he do? Uh, he wrote episodes of, uh, Wolverine and the X-Men. He wrote Hulk Versus with, uh, another dude. Iron Man, Armored Adventures, The Avengers, Earth's Mightiest Heroes. He's a writer for multiple season one and two episodes. So a, lo guy... a lot of Marvel cartoon shows. Uh, and uh, and Star Wars, but yeah, that's di that's all Disney now. We've unlocked a bipolar attack. So here's this guy who's done primarily comic book stuff over and over, and now he's doing Cowboy Bebop. Yeah. That's quite a style change. I'm not really looking forward to that. Uh, yeah. I, I've been surprised before. We'll see. Oh, God. We haven't watched the, the, the movie uh, Death Note at all. Oh, no, we haven't. The yeah. Netflix one. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like we owe it to ourselves, too. Yeah. To do a watch of it. I, 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 want, I, want, to see, I want to see the cross cast. Like... The, uh, Light Turner and and L, who looks we still like... haven't watched the the third like Japanese one either, right? The is that the one oh, with the, the inherited genes? The inherited the genes. <laughs> yeah, no, we haven't watched. Which you want to watch? If you were to pick an order, would you want to watch uh, the Netflix one first and then the third Japanese one, or the third Japanese one first and then the Netflix one? I don't care. I barely <laughs> remember the first two Japanese ones. <laughs> Because it's live action, you see. We, we... We're look... Also, he, he did primarily animation. He's switching to live act. Well, no, he did live action movies before. Ne never mind. 
Although I will say that, uh, that, uh, Dark World and Thor Ragnarok were received as being, like, pretty good, so... Could be because of him, could be not. Yeah, so they cast, uh... They cast Spike Spiegel, Jet Black, Faye Valentine, and, uh, Vicious. But yeah. they didn't, but they didn't cast Ed. I mean, she would be a difficult one to cast for. Just kid characters in general tend to be. Yeah. Child actors are, are a bit hit or miss. They could, they could, like, age her up. Maybe. Yeah, what's the point, then? <laughs> I don't know. Looking around the internet for a key maker. Who that? What the? F Wait, what the fuck? What? People also ask: Is Jet from Cowboy Be Bebop black? No. Is Jet black? Yes, yeah, that's yeah. his name. His voice actor, Bew Billingsley, is black, as I recently found out. I didn't actually know that. What color is Spike's hair from Cowboy Bebop? Green. Fluffy green hair. I, I, I guess? Wonder, I wonder if, uh, if they're gonna ha ha have the guy playing uh, Spike dye his hair green. I always thought of it, I guess it's like super dark green. I always thought of it almost brown. Gray or black. Yeah. The... Does Ed get better? Ed was always good. Does Ed get better? Yeah. What? Is that a, a Google better, question? A yeah. It's like, is that a better character? As a better character? Did she get sick at some point? <laughs> she ate the pudding and people thought she died, so they were like wondering. Or maybe they're like, oh, that's not a good character right now. Does does she get better? And those those Americans. Oh, the, this little Ugu anime girl. What's she doing in this manly bounty hunter series? You know what's great? Contrast. Yeah. That's why. That's why Kipachi is a much better character because he's got like. Like a surrogate daughter just watching over him, cheering him on. That's that's what kind of makes him endearing as well. Yeah. Just, now, now, you can cheer. Just sit over here and watch me tear apart this bad guy. Okay, kitty! I must rampage. I must rampage. <laughs> How do you get a point across a character very quickly? You need three blue frags to destroy. Yeah. Sorry, we're still de-icing the internet. Yep. Just tell... You want me to go all the way back to tell your brother shit? Really? <laughs> shit! This game's too short! We need, we need to... We need to extend the runtime! <laughs> Add footwork! <laughs> Step sword is pretty funny. What's in here? Meet Med Cloud. Med cloud. Eh. Oh, I think we medium have that. cloud. Virus. Anything cool? Eight hundred bucks. Sorry, eight bucks. Lots of clouds. Ten bucks. Oh, Mister. hello. That's pretty cool. It's a better uh, code than we got, too. We got a Y. Yeah. Uh, get rid of Cannonball. Or no, no that Cannonball's just... alright. We're not using the Cloud a yeah, whole lot. Yeah, get rid of the uh, little Cloud. The Cloud and the Bombs. Well, the Bombs are still coming in handy. Mm -hmm. 
Under net four. Calm down, come back! What? What? Calm down, come back? What? Should, should we be here? No, you don't want to go there! The enemies are really fucking tough! I'm a land Hikari. <laughs> oh man, can you imagine the land on the talk show, talk show circuit? Yeah. Just going, ar going around about how we saved the world. Land, who do you think you are to try to take it upon yourself to break into other people's computers to find viruses? I'm land fucking Hikari! He just gets a big old ego. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is the complete the game door. Can't go through here until you beat the game. You need the And who know at least 130 types of chips. Oh. Wow, we're going- we can go deep! We're going deep in the- How deep do we go? How deep in the deep, dank, dark web? Who, who do you, you think-, think you I'm a Lan Hikari?! <laughs> Even gospel people don't mess around in this area. Don't think you can return alive! Yeah, I'm, I'll just... Oh, what? Number Man! Number Man! Wait, what are you doing? Oh, yeah, that's right! His uh, owner is on a John Wick-style quest to get revenge on... I wanna, like, I wanna go see him. Number Man. How do I meet Number Man? Probably wander up there. Just... Hundred... <laughs> Can you get some really cool chips in here anywhere? Hundred! It's probably like three hundreds in a... <laughs> it's just a hundred... Nothing else, huh? Oh, wow! You'll take this one dollar and you'll like it. That's that's kind of uh just a, it really is just a dollar. Oh, there we go. Keep that. <laughs> I'm gonna go revitalize a bankrupt company with this. Uh, I'd say Gator, but that might not hit. On the other hand, you got Step Sword. Oh no, Step Sword won't be enough. I'll have to try Gator. Wait for them to work forward? No, they don't move. They just hide behind their rocks. We'll see what the angle's like. No, it wasn't even enough to- it destroyed one rock. He doesn't know where to go, his rock's gone! Mag- mag- I, I guess, sure. <laughs> oh! So is that a, that's a ninja, right? Yeah. Come on. Come on! He needs to heal up. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah? Well, how about this? Fuck you. Lost a little health there. A little bit, yeah. It's fine. You'll just kill a couple of things and then you'll be right as rain. Those kunai guys can have useful chips. You just, you know, need to get them. Yeah. So he's on his own little platform in the middle there that we need to warp to from somewhere. <laughs> so this is an easy way to just grind money. Just keep, come yeah. there when, when the programs restore. Save and reset to get it all the cash you could ever need. Kills here. This is the flare that kills. Kill flare. Kill flare. Oh, it's Zeus Hammer. <laughs> I guess that'll he'll still survive that a little bit. Oh no, don't do it then. And we'll also be uh we'll also take all our health. You can you can time the step swords uh right. Well no, that won't neither of them move. Oh shit. Uh, I wouldn't risk the last of your health on that. Yeah. Oh, that was not as bad as we thought. <laughs> oh, hey, they weren't actually threats. Look at that. You're loaded now. We are. I'm, I'm gonna be if I have if I do stuff off stream, I'll have so much money. Be able to buy all the HP ups. Yeah. Become the tank. Oh, we got clouds. Oh. 
gave me. Uh, uh, how much will this do? I, I can only add 40, so 190. Damn it. Damn. Nah. Oh, well, I'm not dealing with you. No! He can't uh -oh. escape! They're too powerful! <laughs> well. <laughs> well, I guess he was right. We wouldn't return alive. <laughs> you won't return alive? Well, that's fine. We got time. Where the hell am I going? We have time travel capabilities. Oh, there's an exit. Six! How deep does this undernet go? Oh no, you really fucked up! You don't want to be here! Yeah? Number man's here. How bad can it be? I'm not gonna hold back. Oh, what? hello. Uh, okay. Hi. <laughs> uh, please. Little, 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 uh, dog feller. Wait, but aren't you gonna... Nothing you... Anything you do will do one damage to him. It's oh, just whack-a-mole. Really? That's dumb. This guy was in the previous game, and he has he has a very rare chip. But you need to play whack-a-mole with him. Yeah. Until he... Just keep Airman for a good measure. Oh, I could, I could Gator. Uh, Gator won't work, No, though. there's no point. <laughs> That's a fine. I have instant. I have instant reaction times. So if you hit a hole, then you won't get the prize. Uh, you will not have time to fire again to hit him. Uh. So really, it's just which road does he appear on? Yeah. Gotcha! Did you really need... Pop -pop. So what's pop-up do? Uh, it makes you invincible until- unless you're attacking. Or invisible when you're not attacking. Oh. So, so if you attack once, it goes away for the rest of the- No. No? Oh! You, you're vulnerable when you attack, and then you go back to being invulnerable again. And it lasts for quite a while? I don't remember exactly how long it lasts. Mag Mac Daddy. Uh, Gator would be nice here. I don't got it though. No. Just gotta go for it. That saw blade looking motherfucker. <laughs> gate spam! S rank, that counted. Even without Gator, Gate Man's a good chip. Yeah. Gate Man's the best chip. Mr. Fantastic. Oh! Little bunny program, what are you doing here? You look lost. You're. So this, this was not planned, we just happened to be the part of the game where I guess we would go into the undernet because fuck it, we can. No, we can't escape. It's too. They're. They're too strong. We need to power up more. Maybe that vendor has some shit. There's a vendor? I thought there was a vendor up there. Is there not? Yeah, past. Oh. Yeah, we have a... S license cube. Because we're masters at, uh, at what we do. Yeah, there you go. Regular memory up. Vendor. How much memory you got? Uh, not enough for anything good. Oh, okay. It's 32. You sure you saw a vendor? I thought I did. On the other side. Oh, well. I guess not. On like the left side of the area? I th I thought there was. A, I I guess I guess I was wrong. There's an empty platform. We can't Gator. run from the battles. Hey, look! Challenge and is has returned. That's right. We can't just run from anything that doesn't uh, immediately spawn with Gator. Cloud ship. Big cloud! T. It's not a great code. Strong, but not a great code. 110 for every... Oh, uh, that, that's useful. Ah, eh, fuck it. Pop-up will be handy for, like, for, like, buying time. 
I, I don't see. I don't see no guy. I don't think there's a guy. You want to fight this thing again, Gator? <laughs> what will this do to you? Nothing, I'm sure. Nine. Wow, that's a strong dog. I remember in the anime they had one of those viruses as like a pet, and that was the rush. Ah, uh, that's that's adorable. All right, that's, I'll take it. Yeah, that's not bad. There's no fifty thousand. Land, you're getting a big head again. <laughs> he's been uh, he's been like uh, just manipulating the like uh, the random number of generators to get all the best bitcoins. Yeah. Oh, we're not rapid enough. Oh, uh. No. I, I changed my mind. I don't want to get on the fiery ride. Stay determined. Time reset. God. I think seven is the deepest. Ah. Uh. Oh, wait. No, they're double fan. Yeah, I, I noticed that. And I, otherwise, I would have called it out. Excuse me, man. He's a crafty fucker. Gate, man. Oh, good. They can walk on lava. They just explode and they instantly hit lava. That 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 would suck. Yeah. Nothing deeper. Under net seven. This is where we're gonna see the aura fuckers. I just know it. Oh, SS license? Yeah. That's a thing. <laughs> That's Land, let's get on it. <laughs> No, we don't qualify yet. I guess we have I to. think you need to beat the game before you're uh, eligible to attempt that. Oh, is that all? Yeah, save the world twice. I really thought this would be much worse. Don't, don't get cocky. Come on. Nice shot. Oh, what? Oh, okay. I guess I can do that. Fuck. Wow, it's fast! Yeah, it's pretty quick. Oh man. Pop up. Oh, I can't I can't move forward to use like gate. Yeah, so just just pop up until the panels are I, I guess so. Yeah? I guess we'll never know how long it lasts. <laughs> I'm glad you were able to give Mega Man, uh, off, like, uh, active camo. Yeah. I just realized something. What? Yeah, you know what, you know what, uh, anime I think my, uh, my brother would be into? What? Uh, yeah, I think he'd really like Ghosts in the Shell. Yeah? Yeah, he's, uh... A cyberpunk kind of guy. Well, he, he's more into guns, and Ghost in the Shell has like a lot of like uh, cool gun, like weird guns in it. So I guess it's not really the focus of the show. It's yeah. a lot more a lot of political stuff. That's true. With very rare occasional ac action sequences. He has uh, he has uh, we have talked about like there's this he's talking about oh yeah there's this anime in which like all the all like the the main character characters are like girls that are guns, and I'm like, oh, you're, you're talking about, uh, you're talking about girls' frontline. It's like, he's surprised. Oh! It. Yeah, oh, did you? I did it too early. It's just gonna hit the aura. Oh, yeah, that's back. Oh! Oh, that's not good. That's... <laughs> you dead. 
I got faced. Ooh, face! This girl wants these chips. <laughs> she knows what she she knows what she wants. That's a girl with expensive tastes. Oh kidding? wait. Ah. Damn. Bad luck. Let's do it! Zeus Hammer self-destruct. Wait! What? Oh, does pop-up work for Zeus Hammer? No. I remember you're you're vulnerable during the attack. Oh yeah. I wish. That'd be cool. Well, uh, see if there's anything worth getting here, otherwise I I can uh, I'll either log out or I can use a life up if I really need to. Triple S, S, S license! Oh, that must be the good shit. <laughs> Lan uncovers the deepest part of the internet. Grass, oh, grass stage. So it turns everything into grass. You get lots of double damage. Ooh, that, that actually sounds pretty useful. That actually would also isolate a lot of the more problematic panels, so... Yeah. Yeah, why not? Get rid of, uh... They're, they're, they're any code, but they're not, uh... The wind-up kind of kills the dash attacks. Yeah! But it, it, where we need, uh... Because we need, like, higher, uh, re like, reflexes. Yeah. We need chips that, uh, that, act, that can act instantly. Now. And the virus reward rewards are kind of crap here. Well, I can't, don't think we can do anything else here without uh, our sp Wait, special what's, super what's licenses. Top? Did we not check that one? No, I don't think we did. Is that S? Oh, it's two double S's and a triple S. Yeah. Okay. So this this is all stuff we can't do until uh, end end game. Yeah. We'll be back. All right, lady. Let's go back to the house. It's just a place on the internet. <laughs> yeah, that's right. We this is uh, this is just running back and forth between Netopia and the Undernet. We're basically playing convoy. Yeah. This, that is boring as fuck. At least we can run from battles again. You yeah. don't know what you have until you lose it. We're also fucking made. <laughs> after, after that one job and two fifty thousand mystery datas, we just robbed some bank in some foreign country, right? <laughs> it's fine. It was a. Uh, it was a. Uh, they had some funds it, funneled into the undernet. Yeah, it, it was a. Uh, it was like uh, offshore's bank accounts for corrupt corporations that don't want to pay tax. Land just stole it for himself. Yeah. So that they can't have it. Oh, that was the wrong way. So he can proceed not to pay tax for it as either. That's right. Oh man. Land Akari's net worth is like five times that of either of his parents. <laughs> he starts going to school in a suit. <laughs> and the teacher's like, that's not all nice, but you still have to do your homework. Oh, what happens if I fail? I still am very rich. And then just, Ms. Mari's just like, <sighs> Land. That's why Yai is friends with him. <laughs> why she's willing to, uh... Land, like, she, she knew he was gonna be rich one day. I checked your bank account. You're now rich enough to be my friend. Congratulations! <laughs> and Land's like, Ah! Uh, well... I don't know. Ma male, male's a sugar baby. I don't know what the fuck Dex brings to the group. He's the bodyguard. That, he's yeah. He's that, he's the secret service. He's Lance, dude. He he's friends with Lance. Friends with him because he's a big tough motherfucker. Yeah. And if people are going after him, he needs a big tough motherfucker. 
You want to see Mr. Ikari? You go through me. <laughs> oh God, is this is this gonna be? Is this whole series lands like for like descent into villainy? Is it by by uh, four? Is he gonna be like forming a team to like do uh, to like do crimes across the internet? Yeah. Is, is this gonna be the Metal Gear Solid plot line where we're actually finding out that this is a, a villain's pr like journey to being to being like the villain? I, I don't know. I've never played four. It'll be new territory. Four, four's the end of the series. Uh, I'm talking more about the middle, like three and five. What? I'm, I'm talking about Battle Network. Oh. oh. I thought five was the end of the series. Uh, no. There are six games. Which one did they do the epilogue for? Epilogue? Yeah, they did a. I thought they did a distant epilogue for like one of the games. Oh, I have that was no idea. To be the last game. I haven't and then heard they of that. Another one. I hadn't heard that. So I have no idea. He's flying every day. He could potentially fly every day to go to America. Like, he he's is a VIP. Wanted. Oh gosh. Before he started off as an everyday high school kid, then he saved the world once, ma ma managed to find a way to make a lot of money capitalizing on that, and his arrogance is showing. He knows the algorithms. <laughs> he knows the secrets. He has, he has the evidence. House. This is my house! <laughs> Undernet 3 seems fishy. I hear a connect- There's an under Kotobuki? There are multiple undernets? Oh, there's- they, see, the, see, one side of the undernet had a falling out with the other side, and they decided to, like, split off into, like, uh... Oh my god. Where's the rest of the blue frag? I'm gonna guess it's somewhere near Undernet 3, because this guy said Undernet 3. It's 109. Yeah, I'm gonna... We'll, we'll call it here. We'll, this, is, uh, uh, th this is taking multiple streams to get through, and we're not even coming up with interesting... We resorted to social commentary! That's not a good sign! We, we... We didn't even get to the end of this particular Navi, this arc. I mean, granted, we're approaching the... We're getting so pretty much is, at the end this is game. The worst, this is the worst stretch of the game, then. This, this is arc. the most tedious, yeah. Yeah, the... I, I would like to say they learned their lesson in three. I would like to say that. I would like to say that. <laughs> Pretty much this exact same thing happens at one point. Of course three. it does. I don't think it's as bad with running. I, do, I don't know, remember for sure, though. But you're you're running now. What? Yeah. Oh. No, that, that, that's going to be it for today, though. Next time we'll come back, we'll spawn in front of this Navi and say, Oh, Under, Undernet 3. And it won't seem so bad having to go there, because we won't have just been there. Yeah, that sounds about right. Thank you for watching. We'll, we'll see. see you guys next time.